specific challenges in this um, with this process with uh, how to deal with the narrative, which is fairly thin, uh, almost non-existent in the, in the original plot. So uh, I had to keep the the, the the finesse of it and deal with some of the narrative in much more allegorical ways, and make room for symbolism, and uh, also find the points that were extremely important to tell and that, that I wanted to sort of highlight. What I really find fascinating about uh, this music is its uh, emotional potential. Uh, to find a suitable form that uh, will uh, embody that uh, emotional potential. That, that has been my challenge. Music is uh, it's like a big bouquet. Of, uh, of uh, sonorities in comparison to uh, maybe ballet music of that, that era, it's, it's very modern. So it's, uh, one has the impression that it's, it's, one is swimming through a thick sea rather than standing on, uh, on the grid. I think I'm treating it much more uh, as, a, as a triangular love story. A strong desire of, of its main protagonist, Josef, to uh, not have a relationship to uh, a person, but to, uh, to a divinity, to something that is much more abstract, or aspires to bigger concepts uh, than, than human concepts. So that's, that is sort of uh, something that I haven't, I haven't felt the necessity to, to change, because that's what that was quite interesting, how uh, we dealt with this. Uh, this conflict uh, between his uh, more human self and his, and his aspirations. Mm -hmm.